Today is a very special day. As soon as I drink these, I feel healthy. <laughs> we ordered way we too much. much. It's sickening, dinkening. I'm a Pilates princess, I'm a Pilates princess, I can do this. Perfect. Go potty. This thing is so loud, <laughs> but it feels so good on the skin. Are my eyes looking red? Oh my God, I look like I got beat the fuck up. Wow! Goodness, my tripod's downstairs, so you're currently balancing on my skincare fridge. I told myself, since I am now in control of my life. Well, I've always been. I told myself, no matter what, if I wake up late, well, not late, but I don't know. I'm very weird when it comes to like sleeping in. I don't know how to like describe it. It's just such a weird feeling. I always feel bad about sleeping in when it's like, girl, you're fine. You know, like as long as you get your work done, I don't care what time you sleep in till. No matter what, every day has to start with you. And I need to put myself first, move my body in whatever way that means, do my skincare, you know, like just make sure I feel prioritized before jumping into anything. I'm currently getting ready to do a little workout at home because it's already 10 o'clock. I don't feel like driving all the way to the gym, driving home, that just takes a whole ass moment and I bought stuff to do workouts at my house, so I think what I'm gonna do is actually go for a little hot girl walk around my neighborhood, I guess, and, oh wait, I need sunscreen. I cannot leave without sunscreen. But I think I'm gonna just do like a little hot girl walk around my neighborhood, get my steps in for the day, listen to my podcasts, um, and just like romanticize my neighborhood a little bit. I always tell myself, like before I go on walks, ugh, I don't wanna do a walk because my neighborhood isn't cute, it's not whatever, but it's like romanticize what you have. We're switching the mindsets and instead of wishing for something else, we're gonna be grateful for what I do have and definitely don't get scared to walk around by myself, which is something that I should be grateful for. Birdie, I wish you would go on walks with me. Oh wait, Tino. Since you're here, would you like to join me? Can you believe it? I have literally two dogs, a pit bull and a chihuahua that don't wanna go on walks. But my sister left her dog here for the for the week, I guess. Tino, you wanna go on a walk? You wanna go on a walk, Tino? Good boy. Let's go. I need to find a poopy bag for you, though. I need to find some poopy bag for you. Hold on. Hold on, let me find a poopy bag. Well, you need a leash before we go anywhere. All right, you ready? You ready? Hold on. I really wanna start my Pilates princess journey and I'm still trying to find like a Pilates studio in my area but it's kind of hard and to be honest I don't feel like paying for another membership because I'm already paying for like hot yoga so we're gonna just make a little Pilates studio at my house yeah I want to do a lower body because I feel like what I really need is to start doing like a low impact lower body workout and then obviously either Thursday or Friday do like a heavy weight training day to like combine, you know, Pilates, low impact, rubber bands, resistance with like weight training. I'm playing around with my workout split. I'm kind of just like feeling it out and just doing workouts that I feel, you know, powerful in and yeah. Gently warming up our spine here, pairing on your exhale, pull your left knee up to your left armpit, inhale, extend 
send it back. Exhale, pull your knee forward. Inhale, Wait. Extend. I'm going to make everything harder for me, and I'm just putting my ankle weights on. I got these from Target. They're only like 1.5 pounds, but they're something, you know? That you're keeping your core engaged, and you're creating a one long line all the way from the crown of your head to the tip of your toes. So you lift, tap to the left, lift, tap to the right. Just eight more. Just six more. Five. Four. <sighs> Three, two, and one. Well done. Release your arm and your leg. Holy shit. down to your hips to activate your core muscles. Let's do two more. Making sure that they are facing towards the floor. Really using your three, two, and one. Good job. Release your arms and your legs. And let's press back into a child's pose. With a soft bend Doing good. And hold the third one and reach and clap behind your thighs. So you switch for one, two, three. Well done. Hopefully you are feeling it in your abs. Yeah, I'm feeling it, girl. I'm feeling it. Roll your head and shoulders up. Come up to seated. How the? Hold on, I can do that. Inhale, roll. <laughs> shit. I guess not. And exhale, arms reach. Oh. Oh, never give up. As you lift your arms up, make sure that you're dropping your hips down to your hips. I'm a Pilates princess. I'm a Pilates princess. I can do this. And two. It's all about breathing, I think. Hold your arms in front of you. Four. And three. Really twist. Two. And one. Return through center. Roll yourself back down. Thank God. Keeping your lower back, pressing down into the floor. Inhale, lift. Put the ankle weights on. It'll be more of a challenge. Three, Bitch, three, this is already a fucking challenge. This is really working our whole entire core. So nice and level. And that you're really pressing down through the heel of your right foot. So there, nice and relaxed. Really use your abdominals to get harder. You can do it. Really crunch up as high as you can. I am shaking so bad. Straight. Oh my god, there's no what? Rocker position. Same thing. Inhale, roll up, find your balance, open through What the fuck? Oh, 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 oh! Now oh, oh. oh, oh. roll up, oh. straight spine. How does she do that? Oh, oh! Huh. Well done. Hold yeah, look at that! Wherever you are, bend your knees and find your board pose. Oh, wow. On your end, your ribs. Yeah! Your hip. I low key am killing it. And draw your knees down to your underarms. Trying to get to prayer. Thank you. That was challenging. Like, I'm not sweating, but I'm burning. I'm burning up. I gotta do my research and find. Um, like, that one was really good. I just followed Move with Nicole's 35 minute abs and booty. My booty was pumping. That was great. I feel good too. Like my body, like Pilates and hot yoga just makes my body feel so like stretched out and I love it. So that was amazing. Agencies that are, well, I don't even know what really to like call them, but the one is more so like a modeling agency for like fashion and beauty. Wow. Yeah, like they're, huge collaborations and i'm just like i don't wonder why are you reaching out to me because <laughs> i'm not a model but like i don't know i just i kind of feel like the second meeting today that i have is definitely the one that i'm like really anxious not anxious for but like i just could not sleep last night because i was getting like excited and then like nervous i don't know i'm gonna i don't even know I'm just nervous. I get so nervous because I don't know like what to say. Today is a very special day. I'm like, my stomach is so anxious right now. Just filled with so many butterflies and just like knots, you know? <sighs> Let's get some words out, Jay-Z. 
Basically today I have two meetings with two potential management. To be honest, I don't know how any of this works. I don't know. I am freaking out. This is something that I'm not gonna lie, I've been wanting for a little bit now. I'm handling a lot of shit that I don't necessarily know what I'm doing. And I know obviously I would just benefit more if I had somebody to help me on the back end when it comes to like emails, negotiating and all that stuff. I'm very anxious, I'm very excited. I was looking high and low about what these agencies are doing and just like who would they represent. The one is more so like a modeling agency and that would be so cool to like actually maybe get a foot in the modeling door because that's something I've always loved. My forehead is breaking out so bad. It's just pretty cool to see like the brand, the managers that are representing the girls that I like look up to and follow, them reaching out to me. Like, is this real life? Like I, I'm just like, Pull out the cameras, like punk me right now. The fact that this is happening today, I'm, I'm scared. Well, scared in such a good way. Scared in such a good way. Because when you are scared, that means big things are coming and that's important. Being scared is, fear is low key love. You know, like when you're scared of something, it means you really wanna do it. And you just don't want to mess up. Get ready with me for two meetings that might change my f***ing life. Story short, I am meeting with two managements today. What the fuck is my life? Last night I was having the worst imposter syndrome. I've been posting videos for a while now and I'm scared of the unknown. Extremely uncomfortable when it comes to meetings. I've only ever had like one Zoom call, but that's good. That means you're doing something that's potentially gonna make you uncomfortable, but then in the end you're gonna become comfortable and it's just going to be a learning experience. Whether or not anything happens after today, every time I think about like what I'm getting ready for, a pit fills my stomach. I feel like I'm a really bad speaker and I don't ever makes sense times my words come out slower than my mind is thinking i just get very insecure because i feel like my words sound stupid that's definitely something i want to work on i told myself i wanted to work on this year so here we are getting onto a zoom call scary everything always happens for a reason I've only been like full time i guess you could call it for like maybe two three weeks I was working at a salon recently to help with their social media and to do like makeup on the side which I still do if you live in the PA area. I know I will definitely do your makeup. Got to a point where I just said, never gonna be happy unless I dive into this. The only thing I ever thought about, the only thing that brought me happiness, that's the long story short. I truly just took a step back and showed my true authentic self on the internet, which sounds fucking terrifying and it still is, which is why I don't think about it. I just post. Being yourself is always the best bet. People are gonna judge you whether or not you're putting up a character or being your real self. So might as well just get bullied for who you are. Find the people that actually genuinely care about you rather than being somebody you're not and being so unhappy with the persona that you're creating. It is Wednesday, March 1st. Starting the new month off on a great freaking note. I feel like I'm more excited about how scared I am. And I know that sounds really bad. I've never been the type to want to stay comfortable. I always am eager to learn and to grow and evolve. Today, I feel like that's what the vibe is, you know? Hopefully, I'll learn today. If you always think that you can't learn more, you're comfortable, you're content, so you don't want to try anything new. Like, that's where successful people and people that are comfortable, like, don't compare. You just face all of these fears head on. You can be scared, but do it scared. I already believed in myself. Don't get me wrong. I'm a Leo over here. And when I do something, I do it. There's so many things that I want to accomplish, like creating a podcast, modeling for TV commercials. Like, I don't know. There's so many things that I'm going to accomplish that I haven't even thought of, you know? Not to sound cheesy, you literally only get one life. Why would you want to spend that one life living in a life of regret and what ifs? I just, I couldn't do that. I'm not letting this life go to waste. It's not an overnight success at the same time. I don't need it to be. Some days I'm like, oh my God, I am the queen of the world. And then other days I'm like, I ain't shit. It's truly be like that. Nars Amor for good luck. I wanna just look simply me, but like the prettier version. I get so anxious talking about my life updates. I will do things in silence, see what happens and then speak about it. Like I'll manifest by myself. I don't care of the outcome. I mean, I do. I'm not gonna obsess over it. The the glow was real yesterday and I used the MAC Hyper Real Glow Highlighter Palette. Mixed them all together. It looked so fire. I'm doing that again. I'm beyond thankful for you guys. 
truly. Let me know what videos you guys want to see from me. Let's make 2023 our year. I think I want a little bit of gloss today. Yeah, this is good. Kosas Wet Lip Oil, Jade Revealed. Mm, that's pretty. It's kind of giving Kim K. Just kidding. Thanks for being here. I love you so fucking much. Wish me luck. Um, don't judge the outfit right now. Where'd my remote go? <laughs> I don't know why I'm getting nervous. You know, I'm not. I'm not getting nervous. I'm not getting nervous. Makeup is done. I tried staying very natural, but you know, very presentable. I didn't want to like look like I tried too hard. I just want to look like a simple beauty. Oh my god, I'm nervous as f Be yourself, and that's all you can do. Hi! so crazy because I'm about to wash my face but I was like wait I forgot to 
update you guys. I may or may not have just had a little crying session. In this moment today, I am allowing myself to feel like a boss bitch. Like I'm just allowing myself to feel all the good things and to feel accomplished. Meeting went so well. It was just like everything I've been searching for. It makes me so emotional. I'm not gonna cry on camera because I'm not that bitch. I wish I could just go back and tell the younger version of myself, like, what you're doing isn't silly. Bonjour! Oh, I forgot I didn't have a sweatshirt on underneath my jacket. It is a beautiful day to be alive. It is, well, it's not Wednesday. It is Thursday, March 2nd. I just got home from the gym. I went to the grocery store yesterday. Honestly, I just took like the rest of the day to just like, kind of process my emotions and just like celebrate by myself because I was very emotional yesterday. It was just, it was a lot to take in and it was just all good things. So many emotions, happy tears, proud tears, and oh, I felt so good. I ended up going to yoga and it was just like the most perfect day, even though, like I said, I literally just sat at my vanity all day, but I don't know, it was just, I've been dreaming of that day, you know, like to finally sit down with people that believe in me and see this vision for my content and just like, I don't know, I've never honestly had a true conversation with adults about how impactful social media is and it made me so emotional to just like feel heard and seen, related to and I don't know, it was just a lot. I feel like I've talked about this a lot, but like it's taken me up until like literally yesterday to be like confident and being able to tell somebody like, hey, I'm like a social media influencer. I don't know, it's always taken me, I don't know. It. I've always felt so embarrassed when people ask me like, oh, what, what do you do? Or even if it was like, oh, what is your goal in life? Like, I don't know, I was always embarrassed about it. Not embarrassed, but like I just didn't know how to word it because again, you never know how people are going to respond. So like having that conversation yesterday and did I mention I was on Zoom with like four freaking people? Like everybody a part of the management team, I guess. And it was just, I don't know, it felt so real. It felt so right. And I'm just beyond honored. So I'm just kind of waiting and I'm beyond excited. Okay, let's do a little, let's do a little grocery haul. I didn't get too much, but I was starving on my way home from the gym and I passed by a cute little um, farmer's market kind of thing. It's called the Fresh Market. I got myself a pack of some Celsius. They had like individual cases of the same flavor and strawberry guave, my favorite shit. I also got some cereal cause I'm on my cereal kick again. And I don't know what brand this is. I've never seen it before, but these look like, what's that cereal brand, Honey Wheat? I don't know, I don't know. Organic Cinnamon Harvest. I didn't even know they were organic, so hopefully they don't taste like shit, you know? Whoa, whoa, bird. Don't be slipping and sliding. Some sausage because my breakfast, egg sausage toast. Oh, I'm so excited about this. I got some matcha. Apparently it's like single sips. I love matcha and I've always wanted to like start making it at my house. So we got this. It says blend instantly into hot or cold water or add to smoothies, oatmeal, and more. I didn't know what I wanted for lunch. So I got myself some sushi <laughs> and I also got this balsamic chicken with Greek farro. I don't know how to pronounce that salad. And it looked bomb as hell. So I think I'm gonna have this and save my sushi for a little bit later. We got the boring stuff, some bread. This is my favorite brand, the Dave's Killer Bread. 10 whole grams. <laughs> I don't fucking know. Bread is like my guilty pleasure. I could eat bread 24 seven. I got some eggs because we're running low, but I got some brown eggs. I might sound stupid for saying this, but what's the difference? I have no idea. Every time I go to the grocery store, I always get some kombucha, strawberry glow, number one. And then my number two pick would be the berry lemonade. These are so good. And honestly, I will say, as soon as I drink these, I feel healthy. I feel like a skinny and I just feel like my body detoxing. Like I love kombucha. I got some oat milk. This is Chabana oat milk. Um, I don't really know any 
Like, I don't know many details about, like, different milks. I know I like almond milk and oat milk, but as far as brands, I don't know. So I wanted to try Chabanas because I really like their creamers. Raspberries because I'm a raspberry kind of swore. Pineapple, look how fresh these pineapples. Oh my god. Pineapple and raspberries, favorite fruit ever. Oh, also kiwi, but it's really hard to cut, so I don't get that. And then Chabana. Greek yogurt, mixed berry, so good. Picked up two of these poppy sodas. I love poppy, but I do like Olipop better. And it's so hard finding Olipop. So I think, do you think it's worth it ordering it off of Amazon? Because I'm scared they will be delivered like completely cracked and open. So I don't know if I should take my chance because I love Olipop and I can't find them anywhere. And like poppy sodas are good, don't get me wrong. I, I got this one specifically because I wanted to try the orange flavor, but they just like don't hit as the Olipops do. Cause like if I'm getting a prebiotic soda, I want it to taste like a soda. And these, well, I don't know about this flavor yet, but like the raspberry rose is just like, I don't know, they're good, but they're not Olipop. Your favorite fantasies are That's, together in perfect harmony. Look how beautiful this salad looks. <gasps> Bone gotta eat first. Wow. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. You like a love song, baby. And I keep hitting repeat, beep, 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 beep. I don't know why that song stuck in my head, but I just want to take a moment to look at my little cute big ass water bottle. Like this is my head, and this is the water bottle. How sickening is this? I got it at Target and obviously it's like my gym hot yoga water bottle and it's just It's sickening dinkening. It's so cool It's so, oh, sorry. I just scared the dogs, but I like goes like this then you can bow. Bow. Look what I got <laughs> This is the telescopic lift mascara I was gonna, see, listen, I was gonna make a TikTok because I was like, oh my God, that would do great. You know, like a video would maybe do good. But then I was like, you know what? Like it's so done and over with. Like who cares, it, whatever. These have been my ride or die. I really like them. I feel like they instantly work. I have not, I'm not lying. Listen, I'm not like trying to gas these up just cause these are Kourtney Kardashians, but I have not felt bloated ever since I started taking these. I kid you not. I would not lie. These taste so amazing. I could literally eat the whole entire, uh, what are these called? Bottle. I could, I could eat all of them, okay? They taste amazing and they work instantly. I just feel everything digesting in my system. They don't make me like have to poop right away. Like I feel like a lot of detox things, they make you constantly just run to the toilet. They don't do that. They just like, do everything very naturally and it just i don't know it makes my body feel great i've also been really enjoying the lemmy purr vaginal health gummies even though i'm not sure like i don't know how i see a difference in these but they taste good Ooh, these are hot yeah just like i like it air it out you're gonna burn yourself <laughs> friday wednesday the third Mm -hmm. Isn't that crazy? Yeah. Why are you looking at me like that? Well, it's Friday, Wednesday the 3rd. <laughs> I meant to say Friday, March 3rd. Clearly I can't speak today. Mm. Yeah. Told you you would want one. These are just like perfect before the gym. Mm -hmm. I know they microwave their stuff, but it just tastes so good. They don't microwave it. They'll throw it in like an oven, I think. They probably throw it in the same thing that Subway throws their bread in. Mm -hmm. I don't care. It's good. I like Subway. You know. Do we get Subway for lunch? Eh. Trying to not eat as much bread because uh -huh. you can get uh, Don Juan. Mmm. Chipotle. Wow. Chipotle. Yeah, I've been in the movie Chipotle. Okay. <laughs> Cut my thumb. Cheers. Nothing like a good Celsius on a Friday. Gotta hit some chest and some triceps, right? Yeah. I need to work these bat wings.
What the? F That's wrong. Yeah, I'm gonna grab. I'm sorry, you don't get to eat anything. I was gonna say I was waiting because I thought we were gonna cheers or something. Well, we are gonna cheers. I'm just disappointed. Chipotle never comes like together. It tastes good. The sauce is good. Guess what I did? Oh, I'm so excited. I just wrapped up. Wait, are we zoomed in? We are zoomed in. I just wrapped up my official room transformation tour slash journey slash whatever. I'm so excited. You're probably, no, you're definitely going to have watched that video before you've seen this vlog. So I hope you enjoy it. I'm so excited. I hope I said everything I wanted to say. But I'm just, I'm so excited that I finally, you know, recorded the video and that it's going to go up because I feel like it's something that I've not been procrastinating. It's just been taking a long time to get everything done. You know, I'm super excited to have recorded it. I'm going to get that out for Sunday. And now I am getting ready to leave because Cody is currently literally waiting for me <laughs> and I need to leave. Oh my God, is it snowing? It is snowing out. Okay, whatever. I think, I don't know what Cody and I are gonna do. I feel bad, he's been literally waiting for me. Like, he's been waiting for like 20 minutes because I told him I needed to get my B-roll shots at my room for the video because I'm gonna start editing it tonight and get it uploaded for Sunday. That's the thing. That's the thing, huh? Ugh. Putting on Uggs. These cute, you know, trendy Uggs. They're so cute, they're so great and comfy, but they suck to put on. Oh my God, I looked bald for a second. <laughs> We're currently at Panera. I got a tomato soup, a grilled cheese, and mac and cheese because I'm feeling cozy, I'm feeling warm. I feel like I'm whispering really low, but it's like quiet in here, so. I also changed my outfit because it's raining outside. So that's why we're in a cozy vibe. Right, Cody? Mm-hmm. I'm so hungry. Yeah, I know. I'm starving. Like, I want to climb over the damn counter and eat that shit. It looks so good. I think we f***ed up. <laughs> we ordered way we too, too much. much. Wow. Wait, look at that sandwich, though. The ciabatta bread. Mac and cheese. I'm bread so excited ball. for this. Yeah, how, what is that? Good or no? Quiet right now. No, I don't want it. Okay. Oh, there's beans. There's beans in that. There, I think so, yeah. I don't like it. Oh, I just dunked it in the bread. How did you taste that? Look at that. This is mine. Yeah. I love how this morning you were like, I don't like to eat bread a lot <laughs> for my dinners. <laughs> like, yeah, you <laughs> I think I have it on camera too. Trying to not eat as much bread because uh -huh. I eat a, I've been eating a lot of it, and that's usually my breakfast. Like I have bread in for breakfast. I don't know. Today I'm just feeling on edge. That soup is good. Talk about a cozy evening. Mm hmm And it's like snowing. Sleeting. Sleeting, yeah. When it comes to Panera, eating it at home does not. It's not the same. Out. I'm probably gonna have to get my mac and cheese myself. This is like the best thing I think they have. Yeah. Well like that is so sandwiches good. in general. Their tur turkey bravo sandwich, unbelievable. That's just a movie, turkey sandwich. It's good. Yeah, look at the steam. There's the chicken salad. <laughs> Did you watch my last vlog? And are you actually in a group chat with my dad and brother? Oh yeah, they text me all the time. Really? Yeah, look, look, your brother actually texted in it the other day. Because he said that the other day. Who? Oh. Bubba. And I was like, you're lying. What do you guys talk about? Random stuff. Usually it's just your brother sending pictures to him at work. The fact yeah. that I'm already full is bad. I knew it was gonna 
happen. This is way too much. <laughs> what was I thinking? I am hungover as shit. But it is brow day and I cannot wait to get these bitches laminated. I don't know if I'm going to get them tinted. But nonetheless, this is the before. They're looking fucking crazy. They're looking crazy. And I'm excited because every time I get my brows laminated, I feel like a brand new bitch. Getting my eyebrows waxed makes me feel like I could punch somebody in the face. <laughs> this is the after. They're looking so crazy. I also went, oh my god. I don't know how to feel if I'm being completely honest because, well, this brow looks phenomenal. This brow is always the trickiest brow and it makes me so mad. But like in a few days, they're going to look completely fine. I feel like my eyelid is getting stuck. I just have like... <laughs> it looked crazy, but we went we went a little bit thinner because I don't know. I feel like my thick brows, they always look so masculine and there's like a bunch of oil and everything. So they're really like flat, but in a few days, they're going to look good. I still have some tint. My sister does them. So don't think that some random lady just literally let me leave like this, but um, some random lady, my sister. Oh my God. But I left the tint on it because... We're just trying to make it look a little bit thicker because it looked really thin. But these are the brows. Wait, Jason, stop. What? Oh, that was close. I thought it was stopped. Smile. Date night. Third floor. This is for the video. Third floor. Park that did at the C deck. C deck. See dick. What? what? <laughs> I'm confused. Whoa, whoa, what's in here? We'll find one I forgot my camera tonight, so we're vlogging on the phone. We're going to dinner. We're on to go. We're on to go. Um, it's telling us to here, yield. Ooh, uh, uh, uh. Yeah, do we know where we are? Yeah, go that way. <laughs> oh, what the oh, hell is going on? <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I am shaking. Alyssa put together, of course, I'm so mad I'm vlogging on my phone. But Alyssa put together a surprise party for my 100k. Oh my god. You're gosh. welcome, by the way. I just, it's so funny because I was literally, did, I don't know if I Wait, say so we got a surprise good. Yeah, I was shook it because Cody and I were talking about me doing a digital detox. I don't have my camera. I asked Cody if there is a way we can borrow some camera equipment, like a yeah, well, tripod, and he said, how am I supposed to get her to not know that I'm still like a tripod? Um, Look at the balloons, 101. Yeah, because now you're at one. Yeah, we are at one. Oh my God, that's crazy. <laughs> I can't believe this, this is awesome. Yeah, I know I look good, yeah, I look fly Baby, I'm, baby, I'm just your type 